What's going on guys, brothers are brother here and today I'm going to talk about a huge update that rolled out yesterday for both Xbox One and PS4 for Call of Duty Black Ops Freeman. But this update is actually crazy, like this shocked a lot of people. No one really expected half of the stuff that they've introduced within this update right here. But like I said, there's a lot of stuff that was included within this recent update. But I'm going to be focusing on within this video, I'll probably make other videos covering the other stuff. But within this video right here guys, I'm going to be talking about the free Three new weapons that they've added within Call of Duty Black Ops Freeman. Now, previously within Advanced Warfare, you guys would know uh, Sledgehammer would add different weapons or different weapon variants that would actually change your in-game gun stats, so it would make it have a little bit more damage, a little bit less recoil, anything like that. But Treyarch have obviously gone down a different route, as you guys know, where it's just more so cosmetic items, where it just has a visual effect on your weapon or like gestures and stuff like that. But these three new weapons are actually pretty sick. I think it's a really good idea. Now, obviously previously within Call of Duty Black Ops 3, you guys know there was only one special. Usually there's like the right shield and the combat knife or like the ballistic knife within Call of Duty Black Ops 2. But now it's only the combat knife, man. But they've changed this. It was that at launch and now they've changed it within this update. And we, if we hop on to create a class right now, guys, we can see if we go on to the secondaries over to the specials, we can see now there's the combat knife as usual right there, but it's also three new slots. Now, if you look closely onto the right where you can see like the image of the weapon, you can see this first one right here is actually the butterfly knife. Obviously, you can't see it too much because I've not unlocked it yet. You have to earn all of these guys within supply drops, which I think is a good thing. You know, it won't make changes. It will all be the same as the combat knife, but you still have to earn these different versions of it within the supply drops, which is obviously sick. It's something to aim for for me anyway within these supply drop openings, but... First of all, right here, we've got the butterfly knife, I believe. Yeah, that's the butterfly knife, which you see within like CSGO and stuff. Next, we've got the wrench. And finally, we've got the brass knuckles. Now, they're the three new weapons that they've added within this update right here, guys. And honestly, I think they're pretty sick. But I'll show some images on screen for you guys, some better images. If you actually hop onto the arena competitive game mode, you can see when you're on the banner protect system, you can see like these different weapons in like a more clear picture in color as well. So I'll show them on screen for you guys and these look pretty sick people have already got these weapons obviously within supply drops hopefully i'll be able to get these within my supply drop opening this weekend i've already got a whole lot of supply drops man now if you guys are fans of csgo then you'll definitely love this part man i think this is such a great introduction within call of duty black ops 3 now you guys know you can get knives within csgo and when you have them you can kind of like inspect them by like moving them around different animations and stuff but they've introduced that within advanced warfare with the new thing with the new specials that they've had within this update so if you press x with a combat knife now i would show you guys with like the the uh, butterfly knife but i haven't got it yet but if you press x with a combat knife right here it does that little animation now i know it's you know it's really simple but i think that is safe when you're like running across the map and stuff you can just press x to inspect your knife but that's not it as well you can also press the left trigger to do that just look at your camo so if you get some sick camo in supply drops then you'll be able to just check that out because you've added loads of different camos as well within your supply drops guys with this update so you can just spectate that camo just look at it even better and with the butterfly knife obviously the animation will just be a whole lot better you can do this as you're warring as well which is pretty sick but that's the end of this video guys leave a like if you enjoyed subscribe if you are new let me know in the comments down below whether you are hyped with this update man i think it's a really good introduction with aim black ops 3 they're definitely making some changes which is just great man just look at that that's something they should have done for a long time now because the combat knife was just a little bit boring before this but now you can just look at it and stuff it's just sick but thanks for watching guys i might bring another video out later talking about the other stuff that was introduced within the update but i'll see you guys in the next one peace